Hello, I'm going to record for you Kamsan, which is nighttime prayer, Tipuke said before going to bed. So let us pray. O oh God, come to our assistance. O oh Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Now we take a moment to examine our conscience. We think about the day that we've had. What did we do well? What could we have done better? What did we do wrong? Let us ask the Holy Spirit to help us to examine our conscience so that we can listen to it and hear what it has to say. We'll take a moment. We'll read from Psalm 90. He will conceal you with his wings. You will not fear the terror of the night. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High and abides in the shade of the Almighty says to the Lord, My refuge, my stronghold, my God in whom I trust. It is he who will free you from the snare of the fowler who seeks to destroy you. He will conceal you with his pinions and under his wings you will find refuge. You will not fear the terror of the night, nor the arrow that flies by day, nor the plague that prowls in the darkness, nor the scourge that lays waste at noon. A thousand may fall at your side, ten thousand fall at your right. You it will never approach. His faithfulness is buckler and shield. Your eyes have only to look to see how the wicked are repaid. You who have said, Lord, my refuge, and have made the Most High your dwelling. Upon you no evil shall fall, no plague approach where you dwell. For you has he commanded his angels to keep you in all your ways. They shall bear you upon their hands, lest you strike your foot against a stone. On the lion and the viper you will tread and trample the young lion and the dragon. Since he clings to me in love, I will free him, protect him, for he knows my name. When he calls, I shall answer, I am with you. I will save him in distress and give him glory. With length of life, I will content him. I shall let him see my saving power. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. He will conceal you with his wings. You will not fear the terror of the night. Our prayer. Lord Jesus Christ, when tempted by the devil, you remained loyal to your Father, whose angels watched over you at his command. Guard your church and keep us safe from the plague of sin so that we may remain loyal to the day we enjoy your salvation and your glory. A reading from the book of Revelation, chapter 22, verses 4 to 5. They will see the Lord face to face and his name will be written on their foreheads. It will never be night again and they will not need lamplight or sunlight, because the Lord God will be shining on them. They will reign forever and ever. Into your hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. Into your hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. You have redeemed us, Lord God of truth. Into your hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. This is called the Nunc Dimittis. Save us, Lord, while we are awake. Protect us while we sleep. 
that we may keep watch with Christ and rest with him in peace. At last, all-powerful Master, you give leave to your servant to go in peace according to your promise. For my eyes have seen your salvation, which you have prepared for all nations, the light to enlighten the Gentiles and give glory to your people Israel. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Save us, Lord, while we are awake. Protect us while we sleep, that we may keep watch with Christ and rest with him in peace. Let us pray. God our Father, as we have celebrated today the mystery of the Lord's resurrection, Grant our humble prayer. Free us from all harm that we may sleep in peace and rise in joy to sing your praise. Through Christ our Lord, amen. The Lord grant us a quiet night and a perfect end, amen. Ave Regina Celorum, Ave Domina Angelorum, Salve Radic, Salve Porta, Ex Quamundo Lux Est Orta. Gaude Virgo Gloriosa, Super Omnes Speciosa, Vale Ovalde Decora, Et Pro Nobis Christum Exora. That is a hymn to Mary. Hail, Queen of Heaven beyond compare, to whom the angels homage pay. Hail, Root of Jesse, Gate of Light, that opened for the world's new day. Rejoice, O Virgin unsurpassed, in whom our ransom was begun. For all your loving children pray to Christ, our Savior and your Son. I'll see you tomorrow when we start the day with lauds. Bye.